morning everybody Belinda here um I thought I would just show you quickly this is the previous pour that I did with my own method of pouring a medium recipe so I'm not sure if you can actually see all of this lacing going on here and these beautiful cells so that's all dry now and it turned out beautifully all right well let's um start on the next one and this time i'm going to actually pour it out uh tilt it off all right so let's get cracking and see what i can get out of this magic cup So this is my base coat. I'm going to spread that out. I'm not sure if there are lumps in here, but um, if those are lumps, we're going to get them out quick, quick. Put a little bit more on. I will be putting up something in the very near future with my recipe. So you guys don't have to go out and purchase a whole heap of expensive stuff. Let me pull my this guy on. Go in with the yellow first this time. And then I'll put the purple on. This is magenta. go on with blue. This is turquoise. And I'm already seeing um, cells popping up. This canvas is an 18 by 24 inch. Then I'm going in with my white. Well, it's not my white, it's the uh, white that I've made up. This would be my cell activator. Let's give that a torch. So this is um, inspired by the Shirley Art Bloom technique, although, as I said, I'm using my own recipe. Okay, I'm going to give this a blow and hopefully you stay on the screen.
Oh, it was beautiful. Oh, <laughs> I blew that straight off. It happens, guys. Right, let's give this another torch now that my head is all over the show. Lucky I didn't blow it into my other paints. <laughs> that was a big blow. Uh, come now. Be kind. So you just gotta talk nice to it. Uh, there's a lot of beautiful things happening. Tilting. Just bringing that back. I see a gorgeous flower. Bringing it back to the centre. I really like this corner here actually. Let's see if we can keep some of that. So I'm just going back again. This is impressive. And I'll go off here. isn't a lot of paint on the edge here so I'm just pulling it over so I can get to keep quite a bit of what's going on here let's do that beautiful okay I don't quite want this in the center, I would like it to be off center. Let's 
turn that around. I'm just touching up the ends of the side here. Anyway, where I can see it needs a little bit more. And then I'll give it a torch and I'll bring you in to have a look. Uh, yeah, I really want that to actually be a bit more white. Okay, so this has been sitting for about um, 10 minutes and I'm absolutely loving these cells. These colours within colours, really pretty. And as you can see, there's um, also quite a lot of lacing all this lacing that's going on so pretty much um, the same effect comment below what do you think what are your thoughts lots of lacing lots of cells cells within cells and um, I quite like this. I think it's um, turned into a beautiful flower, really. I like the these cells here as well. You can see all of the various um, colours within colours. And that there is really beautiful. And I'm actually glad I left the these corners um, there's negative space and this side as well very very pretty you can see the sides have got the cells as well and all the lacing Well guys, thank you very much again for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye.